in practice with the turkey calls. You gotta be consistent with it. I brought the box call today. Ah. So what I kind of like to do, usually when I go out into the woods, I got like a fanny pack. And uh, I will, uh, I'll carry all this in that pack. But when I'm getting ready for the season, I like to take a box call, uh, tried and true, legendary. And I'll kind of try and mimic the noise with the mouth call that I make with the box call. So let's see how it goes. That's pretty close. That's pretty close. It doesn't have to be perfect. That's pretty close. We're getting a lot better than we were yesterday. That's the goal, right? So, uh, something that I guess needs to be noted is if you're just starting out, uh, it's a lot easier to use like a box call, but it's definitely worth it to use a, a diaphragm call. If you can get to, uh, if you can get comfortable with it, being able to be hands-free while you're in the woods, turkey hunting, it's, uh, it's a tremendous advantage, especially if, uh, especially if you're by yourself. I started on a box call, right? And then I moved to a diaphragm. I like a slate too. Um, the the vox call is the easiest what's up you go uh yeah what's up amid amid i don't know how to say names don't sorry about that but what's up how y'all doing um i do own guns i love guns um i love the second amendment um diaphragm call worth it to learn Worth it to learn. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can do it. So we're going to try and mimic this noise. That's pretty close. We still got a few weeks till season, so I'm happy with that. Y'all doing any hunting? All right, here we go. That's pretty close. I'm pretty, for, for, this is my second day practicing, getting ready for season. Uh, feeling pretty good about that. I gotta learn to yelp. Not yelp. I gotta learn to cluck on this thing, though. I can't cluck with a mouth call. So anyway, yeah, so I'll use this. This is louder. Um, I like to use the box call when, uh, 
when I'm locating. You know. You can also cluck with it pretty easy. You just kind of put your thumb against it. Give it a little pre a little back pressure. And Let's see. I can't do it yet. I can't putt with the mouth call yet. That's kind of close. That's kind of close. Let's give it a rest for a minute. But yeah, so I'll go into the woods. I got like a big fanny pack, right? And uh, I carry basically this rosin. I take this box call and I load the rosin, okay? And I'll close it. And then I take a rubber band and that keeps that kind of stowed away in a nice package and that'll go in the fanny pack. And then I have all of these calls that I keep in this cup and that goes in the fanny pack too. And then I have a slate call, which we'll get back out here. We'll get back out here uh, tomorrow. If, if I get, I'll probably do a few more days without it, but we'll get back, back out here uh, over the next few days working on the slate call too and you just want to spend a few weeks uh practicing uh i've been doing it on live stream since i started the youtube channel but um in the past i've just kept my uh my calls in my truck and uh you just you just want to spend a little bit of time a few weeks driving down the road uh, instead of listening to the radio I just put my call in my mouth and start working on my call. I'm liking that. You gotta get that high pitch. The high pitch is the hard part. You just kind of stick this thing in the roof of your mouth and press your tongue up against the uh, the diaphragm and you it's it's from the it's from the it's like from the belly that's the hard part Started to sound ugly at the end there, but you get the point. <laughs> See, now I'm not loving it. That's why you got to practice. You got to get it consistent. You got to get it consistent. It takes a couple weeks. Oh. Let's try a different call. So when you're looking at these turkey calls, you see that little flap, the long one? The long... The long piece is on the top. 
and the rubber faces out. close that's pretty close all right tried and true we know we can do it with the box call let's get that back out and start trying to mimic some noise there any y'all getting ready for turkey season any y'all getting ready i'm pretty fired up man turkey hunting's awesome couple more weeks couple more weeks what's happening robert berry we're getting ready for uh we're getting ready for uh turkey season just practicing our calls we don't want to get in the woods and start scaring birds away it's a little bit early right now to hear anything back they aren't really fired up yet they're not really uh moving yet oh yeah high part's the hard part that high part's the hard part it's on it's on I think if it started tomorrow, we'd be ready to kill one. We'd be ready to get a bird. It'd be awesome if one walk up right now, but I don't think uh, with me talking to you guys that they're gonna be uh, particularly excited to come check out what we got going on. They might though. There's some sort of wild bird. There are there are birds all around us. What is it? Go check it out, Miss Kitty. Something's going crazy right behind the house. I don't know what it is.
What's up, everybody? Y'all getting ready for turkey season? I know I am. I'm jacked up about it, dude. I'm jacked up about it. I can't wait. Springtime's definitely coming, though. There's a lot of bees flying around. It's the first bees I've seen all year. They're like trying to fly into my house. I'm gonna have to patch up a hoe. It's just a small little hole, but. <laughs> oh. Y'all getting ready for turkey season? Getting close. What do you think about that? What do you think about that? <laughs> Not a lot of people into the turkey calling today. Not a lot of people into the turkey calling today. What's up? All these bees. About to be real buggy. I think I'm getting mentally fatigued. Mentally wore out. I guess that's probably gonna be about it for right now. I'll probably pack back, pop back on in a little while. You find them, Miss Kitty? What's up with all these bees? What's up, Zayden? 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 Am I saying that right? Zayden? What's up, bro? What y'all doing? I don't think I can say that name. <laughs> I'm from America, boss. We're getting ready for turkey season.
Yeah, America. It's just about time to hunt down some turkeys, kill some birds, and then eat them. Oh, yeah. Y'all doing all right? Y'all doing any hunting? Y'all like hunting? Indonesia. <laughs> I heard that, boss. Well, appreciate you tuning in. Can you do any bird hunting in Indonesia? Hmm. All right, I'm going to pop off of here. We'll catch y'all again in a little while.